Hello, this short video by Learn CX will introduce you to the content of our latest course that is CFD modeling using Star CCM Plus. Uh, this is among the latest and the most interactive course that we are, that we are, Learn CX is bringing uh, to you. And uh, this video will just give you some glimpse of uh, the various features of this course. So first we'll see what is the objective of launching this particular course. This course uh, aims to impart best in class software focused training on Star CCM Plus. Star CCM Plus as you might be aware already is uh, is the uh, all in one package uh, for CFD modeling from CD Adapco. The final aim in terms of uh, of this course is to produce industry ready Star CCM Plus skilled CFD analyst. So our aim is to produce expertise uh, ex uh, experts uh, in uh, in Star CCM Plus uh, experts uh, CFD engineers uh, who can use Star CCM Plus for engineering design. We will also review and establish strong uh, fundamentals or base of CFD from theory and practical knowledge point of view. So this course will not just teach you software, it will teach you entire uh, entire broad range of uh, CFD fundamentals and theory as well along with uh, along with training you in software. So what would be the learning curve uh, if one, uh, one participates in this particular course? First, if, uh, if you have interest in CFD or if you want to become a CFD engineer, CFD analyst, if you want to learn how to use CFD, this is the course tailor-made for you. Just go for this course if you have uh, any, um, any interest in CFD. Uh, the candidates or the participants will be first uh, trained in, uh, in fundamental knowledge of fluid dynamics and heat transfer. We will review fluid dynamics and heat transfer for all participants within this course. After that, we will also teach fundamentals of CFD from theory and practice point of view or practical point of view. Then comes the software training. So before we enter into software training, the participant is already having strong fundamentals of fluid dynamics, heat transfer and CFD. So after that starts the software training, starting with geometry creation, meshing, then the actual simulation using Star CCM Plus, how to analyze results, how to make sense of results follows, uh, and how to use CFD as a engineering design tool. Uh, this is what we try to teach. Then the course will uh, will will uh, will undertake a mini project for every participant, which is a sort of a mini project or assignment using Star CCM Plus. And once you complete that, you will have an entire confidence that you have actually uh, actually traveled the path of. Uh, becoming or travel the path of getting trained in uh, in, in uh, conducting CFD analysis. So the course details now. The course details are uh, the level of this course is considered to be basic because we there is uh, there is actually no prerequisite. Uh, the user uh, is uh, is trained in fluid dynamics and uh, heat transfer in within this course itself. So it is a basic level course. Duration is uh, six weeks, which will include the entire course uh, training package, including interactive training, workshops, mini projects, and assignments. Just to let you know, uh, the course videos uh, hours are about sixteen to twenty, which are just recorded videos. But ultimately, what do you get out of this course? You get video access, course video access, interactive sessions with our tutors, question answer sessions, which will be live. You get on demand workshops and demos as well to clear various of your doubts. You, uh, you get to do a mini project. You get to uh, conduct, uh, go through various assignments, which will strengthen your CFD basics. And uh, at the end, you'll get a certification. But wait. That's not all about this course. This course will also give you free access to Star CCM Plus software during the course. So this is actually a software training course where you will get hands-on practice on the software also from our side. And this is all included in the course fees or the course package. At the end, we will also provide you hard copies of lecture notes and slides which will be shipped to your location. So all you need is internet access and you have entire software training hands-on interactive course uh, brought to you by Learn CX. Now we will see uh, what all is the content of this course. So lecture one, lecture one is about CFD fundamentals. It will introduce you to CFD theory, CFD equations, uh, solutions, and uh, the finite volume method. That is the basis of uh, CFD methodology or algorithm. Lecture two uh, is all about uh, how do you install SAR CCM plus, and how do you uh, install uh, our training software. So uh, the first uh, we will see how do you get SAR CCM Plus software for your practice, then how do you install it at your end and uh, what are the licensing uh, uh, requirements. Lecture 3 will be an introduction to SAR CCM workflow. So this is where we start about the software training. 
so first we'll see what is SAS CCM Plus, how to launch SAS CCM Plus, the general workflow or process flow of the entire software, uh, what is the graphic user interface and how, is, how, how does it look like as shown here in this figure, uh, what is the SAS CCM Plus GUI uh, and then we will see the basic uh, structure of the model tree of the software and various file structure doubts uh, or various file structure understanding will be clear in this particular lecture. After that the lecture 4 is about geometry modeling where we will see how to use 3D CAD, create and import geometry within SAS CCM Plus, uh, how to manage or repair or modify your existing geometry, how to clean up various surface, how to apply tags to parts, boolean operations on CAD parts, how to repair surfaces and curves, export parts uh, from the software, how to post process and display geometry, uh, various surface preparation tools, surface repair and manipulation, how to define simulation topology and concept of geometry parts as well and regions. So we'll de this, these are some important aspects from defining your uh, CFD domain and we'll try to see that as well as the difference between geometry parts and regions. And uh, at the end we will see how to create edit uh, regions and uh, all the operations on uh, region creation and modification. Boundary creation manipulation will be the end, uh, last part of this particular lecture. After that starts the lecture on meshing, which is the lecture 5. Here we will see how uh, different concepts of meshing, part-based meshing, region-based meshing, application of surface meshes, surface wrappers, surface remeshers, and how to repair surfaces using automatic tools. We will also see how modification of surface mesh and volume mesh. We will uh, then see how to create polyhedral mesh, tetrahedral mesh, prism layer mesh, and we will see how to repair volume mesh as well and mesh refinement tools as well as analysis of mesh quality before we expo export or visualize the mesh. The lecture 6 will focus on physics modeling that is what are the different uh, different flow modeling techniques, heat transfer modeling techniques and how to set up different models, what are the boundary conditions so it will teach you how to set uh, the set, set up of different physical models, importing mesh for physics definition introduction to steady state as well as transient uh, simulation uh, how to define different material properties how to model flow uh, simulation within star CCM plus uh, how to model viscous regimes that is laminar flow, turbulent flow, how to include gravity within the simulation, how to model temperature or thermal energy, uh, how to specify different boundary conditions, what are the different uh, solver accuracy related uh, parameters, how to use coupled approach for flow and energy modeling as well as segregated approach uh, uh, which is uh, for flow and simulation uh, energy modeling how to set up uh, different solver reference values as well as how to initialize your simulation and, or actually uh, 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 solve uh, the uh, problem uh, till convergence then starts the analysis part uh, or actually analyzing the results in star ccm plus where we will see concept of scenes displayers geometry scalars vectors streamlines contours probes isosurfaces as well as planes and derived parts. How to extract results from SAR TCM Plus will also be covered here. In addition to whatever we just saw, that is uh, the lectures, uh, there are additional content that are also part of this course which will be SAR CCM Plus practice tutorials and workshops, on-demand live workshops conducted through internet, interactive sessions with our tutor, question and answer sessions, FAQs as well as mini project and assignments. So uh, if you are interested in this course, I will suggest you to register as soon as possible to avail our latest discount offers. Uh, so uh, hope to see you in the course as well and uh, if you have any questions, do uh, feel free to email us at info at learncx.com. Thank you.